college. It's new, it's exciting, and it's very intimidating. When people first encounter it, um, they usually don't know exactly how to approach it. The question we're asking today is what to do socially when you arrive at college. Far from academics and the actual new location you're in, it's a very important part of your life to know what to do socially. So we asked people on the quad what they did their first year of college to get by socially. Alright, um, how did you get by your first year of college? Um, well, I tried to get involved. Um, I went through the recruitment process, which definitely introduces you to a certain area of social life, not the only one by any means. Um, um, I also lived in a pretty social dorm. I was fortunate to live in one where people wanted to know each other. Doors were open all the time. And I met all of my best friends on my floor, all from different places, not in the same sororities. Some aren't even in sororities. We just kind of, I don't know, all clicked and kind of went on from there. Um, I also got involved in a couple of different clubs where you meet a bunch of different people. Um, and yeah, I don't know, you just find people that enjoy your interests as well. How did you get by your first year of college? Well, uh, for one, I was pretty busy with uh, pledging a fraternity, so that kept my mind off most things. And uh, having support through a fraternity definitely helped with that. Now, what did you all do to get by your first year of college? Um, I joined two different organizations, um, Star Course, which is a music organization, and then like a campus ministry, and I made a lot of friends at both of those, and I would say that is my friend group I have now. I um, made a lot of friends in the dorms, like on my floor, and my, me and my roommate got along really well, and I also joined a campus ministry here, and um, I got a job my freshman year, so I met a lot of people through that. I got involved in the same campus ministry, so it's called Crew, um, and I met a lot of girls from my dorm through that, and those are like my best friends today. So. What did you do to get by your first year of college? Uh, my first year of college, I hung out a lot with uh, kids on my floor and joined a few clubs and uh, you know made new friends and stuff. Just want to get involved, you know, uh, get involved in clubs, meet new people, and just try new things, see new experiences. Did you know that there are over a thousand registered student organizations at the University of Illinois? Uh, listed online on the directory, there are 1,344 RSOs currently, and it just keeps growing because it only takes two people to start a new organization. Um, it's really easy to get involved in a new club because of on quad day, they're all out on a quad. On quad day, hundreds of the RSOs have booths all out here on the quad so that anyone can come and sign up and join the club. Um, there are clubs for basically anything that you could possibly want to join. You could do academic clubs or athletic clubs, uh, religious organizations, political organizations, basically anything you could think of. I think the best way to get adjusted to college is being friends with all your floor mates and your roommates. I live at ISR in Wardall, 10th floor. I am best friends with all the people on my floor, especially right next door, especially my roommate. Um, so I think the best way to get adjusted is to be friends with those that live with you. It makes going to lunch easier, it makes going to dinner easier, and it makes hanging out so much easier. Especially when everybody has the same class. So my advice to freshmen is to become friends with people on your floor. Give them a chance. They're all different from you, but trust me, you'll love them in the end. Um, there was a lot of tough times, but at, you can find, I mean, there was just so much new things. There was new people, new environment, new clubs. It's easy to get overwhelmed, but at the same time, it's just so much fun to try everything, to go look in things that you would not have thought that you would enjoy and find. think that, like, some things would be so much fun. Like, October Club was, it sounds kind of stupid, but it's, so much fun and it's getting involved really in the most things that you possibly can I mean this one of the last times we're gonna have ever be able to kind of just go and do without any responsibility of having a family or parents so just going and doing instead of just staying in I guess.